Hey guys, it's PunchShack41 here and I'm doing another video and it's a quick video today because I have not been well at all I've been shooting motors last night so quick video uh, I'm going to be doing two videos I think I'm going to be putting one so bear with me Right, uh, I do apologise about the angle and stuff it comes to me just in there doing tea so but I might as well do a video while I'm doing it because I'm bored. Right, uh, the first thing I want to get on to is a Sheffield Wednesday matter. The other night, I think it was Tuesday night, we played the Sheffield United, I think it was under 18s or 8, under 21s. I can't, can't remember as such. But the thing I want to talk about is uh, Gary Dean got two goals. And nice thing finally on the going sheet and hopefully that'll get him back into the squad and start playing more regularly. The thing I got is uh, we had a penalty opportunity and he gave it to one of the young lads and I can't like, he gave it to one of the young lads as if it was when he was on his chance to have a hat trick. And I'm not gonna to attempt to say the lad name because I'm really bad at pronunciation. But Medine gave it to uh, one of the younger lads. And he could have got his hat trick and stuff like that. But the young lad missed it. But Medine was very much like, well, what, people were asking why he gave the penalty, why didn't he take it up to get your hat trick and stuff. And he came out and said, I gave the young lad a chance because I think he's got a big future at this club. I think he's got to do really well. And for a player who's not really getting in the first team that much to do that, it shows a lot of maturity I'm a light just going on my other camera, oh well it shows a lot of maturity and it's nice to see that because I don't think you would get that now nowadays and it's just nice to see that, that kind of well hang on you're going to be good at this club and I want you to do well so you take it and see what see what happens yeah the guy missed the penalty but he'll learn he'll learn from his mistake is how he took the penalty and maybe when he gets another penalty he'll be able to plot it and I, I don't think Medin should be praised a little bit for that uh, he's, had, he's had his fair share of people's opinions about the lad he's a good player don't get me wrong I, uh, we haven't seen much of him in the championship yet to know if he worth the step up I, for, his case, for his case and Wendy's thing I really hope he does because he's a good player he gets in the box well, and yeah, he's got problems off the field. Uh, we all know about them, so I'm not going to go into them. But at the end of the day, when he plays, he gives he gives it his all, and he plays really clever, intelligent football. So hopefully, he can get back into the squad, and I'd like him to get back into the squad. But I don't know who you would take out. I don't know if you would take Bokeroid out and play him. Or what? Uh, the other thing is, does anyone know what the situation with Maguire is? Is he injured or is he just not playing or what? Because when we got him off Derby, a lot of Derby fans were saying, oh, not really worth it, not really seen much of him. Paul from the fan was saying he was amazing. So it's a bit of the cap 22. Uh, I think I'm just going to title this video to Gary Medin Maturity to a point. Or something like that, I don't know, I haven't decided yet uh, yeah, so that's this video, like I said I'm going to do one more in a minute and stuff, so these will be uploaded later today uh, well, either later today or later tonight, I don't know because I've got, like I said, I've not felt really good today so it might be an early night, it may be early, early morning tomorrow I upload this so we'll see. Anyway guys, punch it for you one saying bye and be together later. Bye.